Let us go for inter turn fault protection. Inter turn means turn to turn fault. In between the same turn. Suppose if it is a turn, one coil between the two turns of a same coil, if any fault occur, that is inter turn fault protection. Merge price circulating current scheme, that is differential protection, cannot be used for inter turn fault protection because of the currents at the two ends of winding remain same. The two ends of the winding will be same. Suppose if it is a one coil, if you provide current transformers here, it won't, there is no current flows through the relay coil because the sum of the currents are equal. Differential protection against inter-turn faults is provided only for machines with multi-circuit multi winding, that is a number of coils per phase. If number of coils are used per phase, then we are using multi-turn, more number of coils per phase. Suppose if it is a coil, you can see that, okay coil, suppose a S1 and S2 are the two coils, S1 and S2 are the two coils for R phase, R phase. Similarly, Y phase, similarly B phase. If the number of coils, multi-turn coils, we can use inter-turn fault protection. Merge price circulating current scheme does not protect against phase to ground and phase to phase faults. In single turn generator, example large steam turbine generator, single turn generators, there is no necessity of protection against inter turn faults. However, inter turn fault protection is provided for only multi turn generators, such as hydroelectric generators, we are provided. Multi-turn generators, those are having double winding, double winding armatures. Hence, we are using for inter-turn fault protection. Why we are using in multi-turn generator? Because if any fault occur in one turn, the relay will operate. The relay R1, R1, R1 like that it is there. R1, R2, R2 R3, R also we can use. In, in between two turns, in between multi-turn means here we are provided a relay. If any fault occur in this finding, the currents becomes unequal and relay will operate. Between the turns, the protection is possible by connecting a relay between the turns. S1 and S2 of one phase only. S1 and S2 are the two coils of one phase only. With the progen against internal faults. Two current transformers are connected on the circulating current principle we are using. Under normal conditions, the currents in the stator winding S1 and S2 are equal and so will be the currents in the secondaries of the two CTs will be equal. The secondary current around the loop and then is same at all points to no current flows through the relay coil. If a short circuit develops between adjacent turns, say S1, if a short circuit appears adjacent turns in between S1, the currents in the stator winding S1 and S2 is not equal because due to this short, this fault, what will happen? High current will flow. Low current, low current or rated current will flow in S2. The difference current will enter to the relay coil. Therefore, unequal currents will be included in the secondaries of CTs and the difference of these two currents flows through the relay R1. The relay closes, contacts of circuit breaker to clear the generator faults that is inter-turn faults from the system. This is about inter-turn fault protection. What is inter-turn fault protection? Between the turns, same coil. What are the if any fault occur that will be detected and intimated because the, the multi-turn coils only we are using. For large generators, not uh, for small generators, inter-turn fault protection is provided for only large generators.